Health Deputy Minister Dr. Faustine N. Doug Elial addresses the press. On Wednesday in Dar es Salaam, photo, Harriet Magueta the Tanzanian government was forced to allay fears of an outbreak of the disease after the World Health Organization, WHO, declared recently the death of at least 27 people in the Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, due to Ebola. Advertisement by John Nam Kwahit, John Tech 3 Niam Kwahit, tz.nationmedia.com, Dar es Salaam, Ministry of Health, Community Development, Gender, Elderly and Children. On Wednesday, gave assurance to Tanzanians that there was no Ebola or Ebola-like diseases in the country. Addressing reporters during a press conference held at the Health Ministry's offices in the city on Wednesday, Deputy Minister, Dr. Faustine N. Dugulile, said there was no suspected cases of Ebola or Ebola-like symptoms that had been detected in the country, calling on people not to panic, there is no official report indicating an outbreak of Ebola. We will continue to provide further information on the disease, he said. Dr. Andugulile further revealed that comprehensive measures had already been put in place by the government to contain an outbreak of the disease, including strengthening Ebola screening at international airports, the country's borders and ports with a view to ensuring people who were infected with the deadly disease did not enter the country, operations in the ports and countries' borders will remain active. But the government asks everyone to be vigilant, we encourage our medical personnel to continue with screening, he said. The Tanzanian government was forced to allay fears of an outbreak of the disease after the World Health Organization, WHO, declared recently the death of at least 27 people in the Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, due to Ebola. Press conference was also attended by WHO officials and others from the health ministry. Advertisement